It's race day here at Studio 17 Live, so we decided to hit track time hobbies and hit the tracks. Let the races begin! <laughs> Guys, we are here at Track Time Hobbies. I'm here with the owners, Sarah and Ryan. Thank you guys so much for having us today. You're it looks like it's gonna be a super fun time in here, but before we get into any of that, tell me what slot racing is, because for some that might not know, Track Time Hobbies is new to the area, but it's a returning kind of hobby, right? Yeah, uh, slot cars are 124 scale electric cars that, that drive around on a fixed track uh, using a handheld controller. Okay, so it's pretty simple to do. Yes. Is there like an age requirement for people that are going to be doing this? Uh, we've had kids as young as three and four mm -hmm. uh, here doing it with their parents and grandparents. And then you've got adults like us that love it. Yes. <laughs> okay, so what is it that like kind of attracts people to slot racing? Uh, well, the cars are customizable. Uh, we hold regular races. We sell lots of different parts for them and anyone can, can do it really, so kind of open to everyone. Yeah, it's pretty universal for everyone, yeah. What kind of events do you guys hold? Uh, we have regular races uh, every other Wednesday and every other Saturday night. And then we offer birthday parties um, and we could do corporate uh, team building type events too. Yeah, this yeah. is kind of a fun place to just kind of come, have fun, let loose. You get to race around without like worrying really about anything. There's not really like a safety issue with the slot cars, huh? Every once in a while they come flying off the tracks, right? <laughs> Watch out for flying cars! Right? Oh my god. Yeah. How did you guys get into this? Uh, I worked at a hobby shop when I was a teenager uh, and I've always wanted to open my own shop since then. So you guys just opened in August. How has it been? How has the community been for you guys? Uh, it's been great. There's a lot of folks that are here that, that slot car raced in the 90s, which is the last time that we know of there was a slot car track here that have brought their uh, old cars down here so uh, it's been it's been fun. I know you guys have kids do you guys have them involved with it as well? Yes yes definitely they both like racing. Do they customize their own vehicles as well? Well we haven't done any painting of our own cars uh, since we opened but they do they both do have cars so yeah. They each got to choose one our daughter's nine and our son is six and they are much better than I am at racing. <laughs> <laughs> so who wins in the family who's the best? He is. Yeah, he's been doing it for, right. I don't know, 25, 30 years, so. Yeah, well, I, and I actually hadn't really raced them since I was a late teenager, uh, so I was a little rusty when I started doing it again. What, so. what reignited that love in you? I've been into radio control cars and other hobbies since then, and I guess they kind of have the same, uh, they operate in the same part of the brain. Well, you've got a couple of years on on the kids and whatnot, and your wife with experience yeah. with this. So we'll, we'll see who uh, actually really is the reigning champion today. Okay. I'll have you race against the family and, and me, because I'm part of the family now, too. <laughs> now tell me, do you guys have any other hobby products? Uh, well, right now, we just carry the full line of slot cars, accessories, uh, replacement parts, hop-up parts, controllers. And we do sell some plastic models uh, and paints. So for people that aren't too familiar with slot racing, is it an expensive hobby to get into or is it pretty reasonable? Well, we do offer rentals. So if someone wants to come and try slot car racing, uh, they can rent one of our cars and controllers and race for as long as they wanted. And we do sell a starter kit that has everything you need in it. What is a starter kit? What does it have? Uh, it has a car, controller, uh, a tool to work on the car, and some lubricants for the bushings. Uh, and a toolbox. So it really is like having a real life car. You got to have your toolbox yeah. and just be ready to like fix it up however you need to. Yeah, and they do need some maintenance and you can buy parts to make them faster too. Awesome. What are your guys' hours? A Wednesday through Friday, 5 to 8 p.m. and Saturday, 10 to 8 and Sunday, noon to 6. And where can people get more information about track time? We have a Facebook, uh, Instagram, and our website is uh, tracktimehobbies.com. There you go, track time hobbies. It sounds like the perfect thing to do on a Friday night or any time of the weekend with the family. We're going to hit the tracks and see who the real winners are. We'll see you guys next time.